Hello friends, family, brothers and sisters. It's Happy Fat with Bacon Burn Friday. Sorry I couldn't get one in the light. I had to use a repeat last week. I've just been busy trying to catch up on a lot of stuff. Kind of like uh, marked meat carbs. When you go to organize and stuff, it's amazing what you find you got and you didn't even remember you had. Um, hope everybody's doing well. Um, sprinkles is done for the year, I think, unless they come up with something else. Overall, everything went well out there. Um, Trying to think real quick, y'all. Just try to catch y'all up on everything. Just been running. You know how that is. Life gets in the way and messes me all up. But brought out my cup with me and Brother Bill. Having our coffee together, as always. And uh, this Fatwood fire I'm going to be doing today is for anybody that needs one. I know we got several brothers and sisters dealing with some really hard times right now. So this is also a healing fire for them. This is also going to be a fire for veterans. Tomorrow's Veterans Day. So I know I don't have to tell my subs, but just remember our vets and sacrifices they made so that we have the freedoms we have today. And vets, we thank you. Every day we thank you. I never, I never miss a chance to thank a vet when I see a vet. I always thank them, and that makes their day. It really does, especially some of the older ones that, you know, like my dad was with Vietnam when they come back and how they were spit on and disrespected and everything. So it, it really means a lot to them when you, when you can thank them. Um, also, we have 22 vets in this country every day take their own lives. Anything above that zero is it simply unacceptable. We back the blue over here. As y'all know, my nephew's a police officer. And they do their best to keep us safe as, at all costs, including the, the ultimate sacrifice, our first responders, everybody. Y'all, this might be a lengthy one, but it's okay. I haven't been on here for a minute. Got a lot to tell you. Got a lot to catch up on. Um, My brother down in the Panhandle of Florida, David Burkholder, he was kind enough to send me another package, a uh, mail call. And as y'all know, when I was having the issues with my elbow that we now have found out is this, fin this finger right here. He was kind enough to send me the shavings, the leg shavings to help me out with my elbow. And they, they've come in handy and I'm awesomely appreciated for them. Um, he, he was kind enough to send me a, a big mailbox. <laughs> the sucker's heavy, but I'll show you why in a minute. But... I'm, I'm trying to get a whole bunch in and trying to do it in a little amount of time, but he sent me a letter. Let's see. He said he's sending me a firebox of Gen, Gen 2 Nano stove. That is, that is the nicest small wood stove I have found and, he, and he's giving me the instructions on how to use it if I want to use a Trangia alcohol burner and he suggested watching Hop Pelo I guess is how he says his name P-A-L-E-O Hiker M-D he has a couple of really good videos on the Nano and rates it as his favorite little wood stove Hope you enjoy it. Take care. Stay safe, Dave. Thank you. Thank you, David. That, that's really sweet of you to do that. I really appreciate it. But yeah, this box is heavy, so we about to find out why it's so heavy. <laughs> he sent me a whole bag of, of lathe, more lathe shavings. These things really come in handy. I'm going to put this bag in there. I got all, y'all know I got all this clutter over here. As my mama likes to call it, it's all my, I'm trying to keep all this stuff outside rather than inside. And I've been cleaning, I've been cleaning my room up, trying to get all my stuff, stuff that should be outside anyway that I've got in my room. And trying to get everything organized. Okay. He sent me some more big old hunks of bacon. Them big old hunks. Isn't that pretty? But wait, that ain't it. Here's 
There's some more hunks of bacon. Can y'all see it? Here's the little firebox nano. I'll check this out. All right. So let's get it. Let me get it turned around right. Y'all look at this. Can y'all see it? Is this camera doing this thing justice? Look at that. That pretty knot. Sorry, y'all, the wind is blowing. He cut, he cut a slice so I could see the bacon inside. Look at that. This sucker is heavy. Brother Bill's here. Y'all hear the choo choo train? Told y'all, he always lets us know he's around. Look at that hunk of meat. That right there's something serious. Y'all see my muscle flex on my arm? It's heavy. <laughs> Wow. Thank you, David. That's awesome. In fact, I just gave my uncle. He came down, and he has one of those wood-burning, I call it wood-burning stove, but it's his heater. And I gave him a bunch of fat wood to take home with him because he didn't have none. And I told him, I said, here, just take this because I got plenty. Of, and I had some, you know, already processed down and everything, and I, I gave him a whole box full. So I shared fat wood from everybody from everywhere. Probably gave some of my prize pieces away. I didn't want to, and I didn't. But he needs it, so it's for a good reason. So, but, oh, that's a heavy box. But here's the little. I'm gonna try to get y'all. Sorry, y'all. I'm finding myself with this bad boy. You can probably do solar, solar light, solar ignition with this bad boy. Get my little nano out. Try not to play. Seven minutes already, y'all. Sorry. And it falls right into place, just like it's supposed to, the little thing. And I didn't know this, and David told me about it. Let me get y'all down here. Sorry, the sun's in my eyes. Can't see what I'm doing. Can y'all even see? Sorry. I'm going to put y'all back over this way. Maybe I can see you better that way. You see it? And here's the little nano stove. Ain't she cute? I think she's just adorable. And then it's got the two pins that you can put in for if you're using a train G to hold it up. And this is pretty cool too. It's got the pins in here, but this can actually be used as a a windbreaker to keep the wind out. But it's got the pins right here in the bottom of the tin. I think it's just adorable. She's a cutie. But David, I appreciate that. I'm not Oh, sorry, my phone just collapsed off the tripod, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm all out of whack today. Well, if I can get y'all up here, I'm sorry. Y'all know you get, it, what, get what you see. You see what you get. Um, I'm not going to fire it up today. It's a little warm outside, so. But I will. I will fire it up soon. As soon as it starts cooling off, I got some twigs and stuff over here that... I'm planning on lighting up, get rid of some of my mama's yard debris. And let's see, she fits right back in the box, just like a charm. I'll put my little things, I know I'm dragging y'all out and I'm sorry. It's just been a minute since I've seen y'all. I love you and I miss you and I got a lot to say. And But David, I really, really appreciate that and also, David sent me, and it was my fault. I had said I never had a. Y'all know I collect ferro rods. Like I need that many ferro rods, but like I said before, you gotta collect something. The art behind them is just so beautiful. And somewhere down the road, in my mind, I thought I didn't have a set made with fat wood handles. And I reached out to Linda Campbell from um, Linda Campbell's Fat Wood Art. And she sent me a set. And then 
as I, it's amazing, like I said, when you clean up stuff, it's amazing what you find. Well, that was a mistake on my part because I did have a set that had fair, the fair rods that had fat wood handles. In fact, they are from David, her calder. He had made these for me. And I had misplaced them and did not realize it. Isn't this cool? So we're going to fire up our fat with Bacon Burn Friday with some of his lace shavings and his fair rod today. So, my apologies, David, on that. But, like I said, y'all, it's amazing what you find when you start moving stuff around and cleaning stuff up, getting everything organized. I mean, I got my stuff where I know where my stuff is. I can grab it and go, but it needs to be organized, so. I've been putting it off, putting it off, and I said, all right, after haunt season's done, no more excuses. I'm getting on it. I'm getting on it right now, and, I, and, I, and I'm going to get it done. So, y'all, Brother Bill's here, as I said. Um, he's honking the horns. He's always with me. And, like I say, um, I know Jerbs is trying to do videos every day this week. Um, or this month, I'm sorry, for the vets. So, if you see a vet, love a vet, thank a vet, and remember what their sacrifices were. And with that, y'all, tell somebody you love them, because we're not promised tomorrow, we're not promised five minutes from now. Don't have no regrets, stay humble and kind. And I love y'all, and I'm going to turn y'all around. Good Lord, this thing's getting long. I'm going to fire it up. I'm going to fire it up. It's all right. There, see. Get my little bottomless, uh, thing I got here, the one that I use as a windbreaker. But yeah, it's warm today, y'all. We got 80 degrees today. This weather's crazy. It's cold one day, hot the next. Or it's hot 80 degrees today, and then it'll be like 49 tonight. It's just crazy. some good fat with y'all see that black smoke coming off of it Florida fat wood so there now all right y'all I've drug y'all out long enough I missed you I appreciate it People reaching out to make sure I was all right since I did my same video twice in a, two, both weeks without saying anything. Um, I just been busy. I didn't have time to get one done, and I still had that one on my phone. So I said, "Well, I'll just upload it and make it a healing fire." Um, but yeah, like I say, y'all, I love you. This is a 14-minute one. This is a long one. I'm sorry it's this long, but like I say, I had a lot to say and a lot to tell y'all what's been going on. So. With that, y'all, I appreciate you. I appreciate all my subs. Keep it turning. And Shalisa, Shell, and Linda, keep that beautiful art turning you doing. And if y'all hadn't checked out Linda Campbell, y'all check out Linda Campbell. Linda Campbell's Fatwood art. She's doing some beautiful work with that Fatwood. And uh, David, I really, really appreciate your gift. I, I do. I wasn't expecting it. I know you had mentioned it to me that you were sending me some, but you surprised me. And um, I'm thankful for it. And like I say, let me show them one more time before I let y'all go. I got to show them one more time. But these are fat wood handles. David don't do videos. Not yet, anyway. I keep trying to talk him into it. But he made these for me. Look at that big old beast of a striker. Isn't that sucker huge? I like it. 
If you can't get it struck with that, you're not going to get it. But anyway, with that, y'all, y'all, I love you, and I will catch you on my next one. Y'all have a wonderful weekend. Stay safe, and I will catch you on my next one.